calling cards. One. Across oceans and land, working to connect one phone line with another. Like an umbilical cord, these 5, 10, 20 square cards are more than plastic. These calling cards have heartbeats. Two. We, we survive through phone lines. A cycle of dialing number. On the other line waited abuela. On the other line waited memories. On the other line waited birthday wishes that should have been given in person while eating guava cake. But we, we were here. And you, you were there. On the other line, we waited by pay phones. We waited for your voice. We waited. That is all we had. My dad waited for you. He still does. Three. How do you dial a loved one? When your fingers have worn out from weaving too many memories. When your voice has changed since the last time you saw them in person. Your bones have broken from their absence. Your lips have weathered. Your face is the only clue left of what they might look like now. Perhaps it's best not to look in the mirror. Perhaps you are too ashamed of holding on to old memories. 4. I can still hear Abuelita Alegría's voice. Abuelita, ¿cómo está Ecuador? Sí, sí, Abuelita, prometo que regreso. And then, a long pause. You hear her shuffling the phone, trying to remember which side to talk from. She's not familiar with this technology. I call it old school. Some call it poverty. Abuelita's gentle voice rocks me back to memories of when she carried me as a baby. My face lays flat on her back. She hangs up and I lay gripping onto her words, trying not to let go. Never enough minutes. Five. Calling cards don't have heartbeats anymore. They just hang in the store, teasing you. Now dad stops at the bodega for other reasons. His mouth curls up around the rim of the bottle, longing for one more conversation. I think he believes that with every beer, he gets closer to heaven, closer to her, closer to home. And secretly, I wish that was true. Six. The phone goes unused like the passport in my wallet. No more dialing. And his palms rest spaces where my grandma is buried. And even then, even then, the lines on his hands create borders. Restricting him from getting too close. Dad wants to hold my hand. But mostly, we look at each other hoping to find comfort. He says that I look like Abuela.